Can't you get a crash from the fluctuations of blood sugar from eating just fruit? Well, I have yet to see any primate, particularly the orangutans, enter the hospital from blood sugar problems. No, and guys, you've got to get this one too because that's an important question. What is the essential component in chemistry to life? Now, you can have some argument there that nitrogen is. You can have some argument that hydrogen is because it's found in, in the universal atom. But really, when you come down to life at this level, you're looking at two major components, carbon and oxygen. And carbon and oxygen, and we talked about this in the last two videos, is exactly what your car uses to burn. So you can't get away from sugar, and if you do, you're putting yourself or your cells in, in harm's way. And the only way you can get away from a sugar is go totally to protein. And you're still going to get some, but you're going to go much higher on the nitrogen and hydrogen side. And that's all the acid side of chemistry. Diet polysaccharides, meaning multiple sugars, meaning sucro, meaning sucroses, dextroses, maltoses, these types of sugars are where you find multiple glucoses and fructoses bonded together. And so you have a more powerful sugar. We tend to not call that, I mean, man tends to call those carbs. That's not true. These are called starches. Starches are complex sugars. Carbohydrates are carbon chain foods, uh, fruits and vegetables and, uh, and berries and melons. But when you have starches within that family, meaning complex sugars, meaning dye or polysaccharide foods, you have your sucroses, your maltoses and dextroses, basically your grains, your refined sugars, things like this. Yes. If you're having blood sugar problems, go back to nature and eat your food simplistically, which has simple sugars, simple amino acids over proteins, and simple fatty acids. That's the way nature intended for you to eat. People are afraid of fruit eating? Are you kidding me? That's bizarre to me. That's insane to me. It's a negative force. It's taking the foods away from you so you can't get well. And that's insane.